Where are we going now? You wanna go for a hike? <laughs> we have been in Washington for about two weeks now and we have yet to see the mountain. So guess what we're going to see today? so happy to be here. I have been longing to be back in Washington for almost two years now. So it's been a wonderful first couple weeks. I got to meet up with some other travelers and we went on a camping and hiking trip. Luckily I'm only working three days a week for this contract which is so much better than the schedule I was working in Hawaii. I will say the area that I'm working in in Washington is way different than what I was used to in Western Washington. And the climate is very different, but I'm also very close to really beautiful places like this, so I cannot complain. I have a lot of cool, fun trips planned for this summer and I'm just gonna make the most of it. I think I really needed a solo day and it's gonna be really special when I get to see that mountain. I am covered in chills. <laughs> it's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. I love it. 
<gasps> that was such a difficult hike, in my opinion. It's actually one of the easier ones that I found in this area with views of the mountain. But it was really nice doing a hike by myself. That's definitely the longest one with the most elevation gain that I've ever done solo. So that felt really good. Um, I am going to scope out a campsite in the area. I already saved a few on my map. So I don't know if I can find something creekside or lakeside that would be preferred, but whatever I find, I'm happy. And then I'm gonna make some dinner because I'm starving and I forgot snacks on my hike. Plus, the weather is perfect and there is not a neighbor in sight. last night and I have enough for leftovers so I'm cheating and using the microwave instead of cooking dinner this evening. That typically happens <laughs> when I open this. Numbers. So this is white rice, ground beef, teriyaki sauce, lots of other seasonings, broccoli and kimchi. Nom nom. So I just woke up a little bit ago and I was chilling, staring out the window, looking at the river. And all of a sudden there is this bright flash, like lightning struck so close to here. And then there was the loudest thunder and even Rue was startled by this thunder and she never is. So that was a little scary, a little startling. <laughs> It seems to be passing through now, but I can't even check the weather because I have no service. And I'm really glad it wasn't like this yesterday because I got to have that really beautiful hike. And now it looks like it's going to be a rainy, gloomy morning. So I'm just going to take it slow, relax, listen to some music and 
start to work on some other videos from like a month ago. <laughs> starting to come out. You wanna go outside? Let's go, come on. Oh my goodness. So pretty. just washed my van last week. <laughs> it's kind of impossible to keep clean when you live like this. Worth it. starting to roll in and I have to get back to work tomorrow so I'm gonna start breaking down and head out here pretty soon. I know this morning was kind of slow and boring but that's just kind of the reality of solo van life sometimes. I know I have created a lot of 
vlog style videos lately. So if you guys want to see anything more informative, let me know what you want to see down in the comments and I'll see you guys next time. Mm -hmm.